of the paper like physics chemistry and biology be tougher this yeah. time okay. okay competency based questions it will be there hello everyone welcome back to im public school welcome back to akash talks and right now we have onindita ma'am with us hello. and uh, she is a head of science department of this school so i'll going to ask some questions regarding physics as well as from chemistry and as well as from biology and uh, she will going to give proper guidance to all the cic students those who are sitting for icc and even iesc mainly for your icc 2025 so mam hello akash this side hello hello akash mam nice uh, i got a lot of questions from students and being a teacher or head hod with your brother say a coordinator of the school of im public school mam uh, first question i would like to ask you that how to score 15 out of 15 on mcq you know physics and even chemistry and even biology okay okay, okay okay first we have to understand i understand now that the you know students they have already geared up because the countdown has begun definitely so we have hardly 3 months time from 2 and 1 we can say because right now we haven't got yeah, our three time table 3 months, months, three months we can take her, yeah. so my suggestion at first i'll give a general suggestion to the students and then i'll come to the science subjects or definitely the maths no. especially for the icsc and the isc students for icsc the subjects are many like they have 10 subjects so students they have to have a balanced approach Okay. which is more important now over here my suggestion to the students that during this tenure you have to be focused you have to be passionate about your studies okay now you know like this olympic is a celebration definitely so exam is also a celebration, celebration right from primary till 10 yeah. these children are you know studying and everybody the parents tutors and themselves they are waiting for the results to come out So now they have to enjoy and perform, and the output will definitely the be same. learning outcome will be good. Now the thing is this that over here in these three months they have to focus on three things. First is stress management. Definitely. Second is time management. Third is subject management. They Ten subjects be, they have in the yes, IC, IC, so ICC. Yes. So it has to be. They have to have a planner. they have to make a planner of their own a day to day which is a bit short term planner and the long term planner for the ultimate exams Definitely. so every day and they have to see that planning and implementation should should go hand in hand when you are you are saying them to make a proper time table for exactly. physics for chemistry for biology and yes they will prioritize your subjects like in, you know there are subjects like which are i mean they are also these children they are also a bit confused why you know because they are getting lot of information from the social social media from the mentors Definitely. that you know the you know pattern of paper is going to change i know everything is going to change out of the book out of the syllabus okay so they are bit worried and tense also Definitely. so students it is my suggestion that first of all take that stress out okay Now let me come to our subjects like science and maths. Ma'am, second question which I can ask you that, ma'am, in 2023 and even in 2024, uh, the physics paper was too tough. Miss, I am not saying too tough for me or for you, not only, but for the students. Those were those were there, and uh, it was tough. If we compare with chemistry and with biology, the paper is tough in 2023 and as well as 24. When someone said it's too tough, someone said the paper is anal analytic based or analysis based. so will any of the paper like physics chemistry and biology be tougher this no, time i will tell you that is my suggestion to the students like for icsc students in order to perform well see tough one or, will come tough all of them you know very much you know relative right hmm. they are very much relative but the thing is this see newton's law is not going to change snell's no. law is not, not going, going to change, change. faraday's law is not, not going, going to change, change. okay pythagoras theorem is not going, going to change. change so what are we, we are targeting on is this that these children they should be more as because there's a change in the pattern of pattern. the questions because it is more application based question Definitely. and it is true that this year 25 to 30% of the questions will be will they will have food for thought okay, okay. competency based questions it will be there but no mugging up from now onwards try yeah, to understand yeah, this yeah right thing, the thing is this when you study your subject like physics hmm. and maths what you do 
because your pre boards are there i think most of the school they are starting their pre boards you may be little earlier some school but some school are starting from december no school i am public school yeah we are yes. bit early but the okay. children also i mean even our pre boards they are starting from december only mm -hmm. so in this 15 20 days of time what you have to do you have to you know perform at your best Yeah. Suppose when you get seventy percent, then you know that these are the things which I have already prepared, and I have less twenty percent for my boards. Mm -hmm. 